and get a mist kind of floating down the road with my abaya and the breeze kind of yeah. coming through my abaya. <laughs> it's going to be different without wearing one. I'm getting used to it. How's the money machine? Yeah, it worked. Everything good? All the money machines on our travels through Saudi have been a little hit and miss. Yeah, a little hit and miss, but this is the bank that seems to work for us. So I will put all the details on our um, website with everything you need to know. All right, yalla. Driving in Saudi Arabia. I've loved driving in Saudi Arabia. I love driving anyway. It's a huge thing. Like I love achieving huge drives and road trips and that sort of thing. And of course, I've got my trusty navigator right here beside me, who's done a pretty yes. amazing job <laughs> at navigating Brownie us point. through Saudi Arabia. So Brownie points to Mum, as well as wrangling the kids on the way. We've done really well. Yeah, I think we the flagpole right now. Yeah, I think we've. Um, <laughs> We've navigated the road signs, the driving on the right hand side of the yep. road, the driving on the left hand side of the car. We've all learned to read numerals to yes. 10 Arabic numbers to 10. I know, right. and we'll, do, we'll tell you. Right at the end here. Okay. We'll okay, tell wait. you how well we did with the speed signs when we hand the uh, rental car back because that's when they supposedly hand you your speeding tickets because speeding tickets over here are quite. Saudi drivers common. are notorious for their. Kind of crazy driving like this guy. Yeah. Wow. This is the Stars Avenue Mall, which is another of the mega malls down here. Malls are enormous. Massive, massive. If you guys want to go to a stationery shop, we might find something like that. We'll see. I think we need a sketching book. Yeah. Your Harry Potter sketchbook. But right now we are heading towards the Jeddah flagpole. Well, we think anyway. Okay, we can see from back, way back here, like we're quite five k's or I don't know, a few kilometers away, we can see the fountain in the distance down there on the yeah. waterfront. It's How's huge. that look, guys? <laughs> so big. Wow. Saudi Arabia is pretty much notorious for having the biggest and best of so many things. Yeah. What's the what, biggest flagpole? Yeah, what's the biggest uh, fountain? It and does. The biggest. What's I mean, some of the biggest and best things you guys have found from here? Um, I feel like the, the hotels have been some of the biggest and best with their yeah. like size of their kitchens and things like that. I'm yeah. going to say the highways and the roads. The roads the roads have been pretty awesome, eh? The roads are pretty awesome, man. Fuel prices but have been some of the fuel best. Fuel prices <laughs> have been great. Until you get up into the hills, they get a bit um, smaller and rougher, more, slightly like more in New Zealand. But these highways and motorways that take you from city to city are incredible. Look at all these, there's all these playgrounds. It's actually well set. I've got to say Saudi Arabia is pretty well set up for families. It's um, oops, I'm not sure if that was the right way we're meant to be going. I think we need to be on that side of the area. Oh, really? Okay. But yeah, Saudi Arabia is very well set up for families. Toilets is not so well set up for, unless you're a man. But <laughs> it, if you don't mind using as a traveler, you're allowed to use the toilets at the masjid, at the mosque. Yeah, that's the right way. That's right. So that's a good tip for your travels there. All right, this is the Jeddah Blackpool. Okay, it's behind us. Because we missed the turn off. We missed the turn off, but navigating's going really well. Navigating's going really well. <laughs> We're probably headed to Mecca now. But do you want to? Oh my goodness, we are. Do you want to tell them what's we happened are. to the flagpole tonight, Oscar? <laughs> the flag's not up. The flag's not up. All right, but that was the Jetta flagpole. We're going to show you a bit later. And now we're heading towards Al Balad, which is the old oh. area of the city, and it is beautiful. We want to go visit and just kind of the environment, the atmosphere down there is awesome in the evenings. So we're heading for Al Balad. Well, so we've actually found our way back to where we parked the other night. Yeah, so this is Al Balad, which is the historical centre of Jeddah. And it is really close to the port, close to the sea. So once upon a time it would have been the place where travellers coming to head to Mecca would have come 
in by boat and this was the historical port city, their first stop before they went overland to Mecca. So we just got to find somewhere to park. It's, nice, it's a nice area, lots of it inside is actually just pedestrian so it's nice to see lots of families and people around walking. So what are you doing tonight? Um, well we just had to walk for absolutely miles to go and find a parking ticket for like a parking meter for this area but um, we had no idea what number to put in. It was in Arabic but the guy said that we just saw the parking warden and he said it's totally fine so let's go find an ice cream or something. I need an ice cream. I finally convinced mum again to buy us an ice cream. Let's go. So many cars around. Whoa, look at this old wall. It's like a castle. Look at this castle here, eh? It's so like most of these cities all started off with a like a walled in city, so this would be one of the city gates. Yeah, it's it's really big. It's really big and there are lots yeah, of cats. Big. Double jinx. Jinx. And we get here on ice cream as well. I think so. Whoa, loads of cats. Is there a ginger one? Hey, what Okay, here we are. I think we are back into the old city now, so. All right. Let's find us an ice cream, but the call to prayer's going, so I would say. Everything might be closing up. Everything will close up for half an hour. We have to go see all this architecture before it gets dark. Yeah. So I think they're slowly going through and rebuilding this whole old city. Wow. Well, things are starting to smell nice. Okay, wow, this looks like the right kind of area. Look at the fruit. Yeah, look at this. Mangoes, avocados, apples. Tomatoes, carrots, wow, rock melons, cucumbers, limes, peaches, cauliflower, chilies. Yeah, it looks good. Wow, look at this. Fruit and veggies probably comes from the mountains we've just come back from, yes. Tai, which is meant to be the capital of all their fresh fruit and veggies. Look at these mandarins. Oh my gosh. Okay, maybe I am hungrier than I thought. Oh, look at these. So these are, these are a toothbrush, Harry. Yeah. Should I get one? Like now? How much are they? One real. One real? Okay, we've got to get one. Yeah. Okay. You gotta buy it, and that's how you do a show like that. Have you got one real in your pocket? Yeah, I have. All right, we've got to get one of these. What do you think it tastes like? Do you think it actually is refreshing, guys? What's the name? What is it called? What's it called? Nothing right Oh, okay. Thank you. Check it out, one real. Oh, which one? You can choose one. Um, How many are you getting, Harry? Just one? Yeah, just one. Just one? Sorry? Oh. Oh look, <laughs> oh, okay, Gab was about to fight right into it, but um, oh this is exciting. Do you want to cut it in half so the kids can try it? I'm okay. Oh, look at this, look at it, it's like clipped. Oh yeah, this is really exciting. This is great. Wow. All right. How is it? Tastes like a potato. <laughs> Okay, what do you think? Harry, you gonna have a you gotta have a fight, mate. Maybe. Go on then. Harry's gonna have a turn us off. Oh, he's coming back with change. Okay, well here we are at the shop. You want a job? There's a seat there. You guys could be toothbrush wood wooden toothbrush sellers, Oscar. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, so do you feel refreshed, Gab? No. <laughs> Okay, here he comes back. He probably thinks you want to buy some more. Oh, there's like all these clippings down here, I think. Shukran. Thank you very much. Look how great and fresh his teeth look now. Isn't it beautiful teeth? Mashallah. 
<laughs> Shukran, thank you very much. Let's go okay. to the date shop. All right, we're going to see some dates, Harry. Okay. Wow. Yeah, watch out for the cat. Yeah, there's a little cat down there. But um, look at the different kind of dates. Oh, so this one is officially closed while the court prayer is on, guys. Sorry about that, Harry. You all right? We'll wait. Yeah, I wanted to get some dates. Yeah, it's still busy with the toothbrush anyway. All kinds of. Oh, look, there's one over there that's open. We don't see these ones. Oh, there's dates everywhere. Wow. Shall we go in? Salam alaikum. Hello, hello, hello. Hello. Welcome. Thank you. Oh, wow, look, look at them all. Okay, I think we're going to have to get one. I think we're going to have one of these. Where are you from? New Zealand. New Zealand. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I am from Yemen. Oh, oh, very nice. nice. We like Hello. we like Yemeni food. What was it called? Shala Shafa Shala oh. Shala Shafa. What was it called? That one we had. We really like the Yemen food. What's the Yemen food like? A yeah, Yemen uh, Yemen taste. What is it like? Um, uh, meat. Potato like a, in a little pot. Um, what's the uh, national dish of Yemen? What's the national dish of Yemen? Shafa. Uh, shavar? Is it called shavar? Shavar. Is it like a chicken yeah. man? Yes, very nice. We like it. Yeah, yeah very good. All right, Gab, we're going to choose. I, I vote these ones. Yeah. 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 Should we try a couple of sugary stuff on yeah. it? Yeah. Okay, this is the most dates we've ever seen. Salam alaikum. New Zealand. Wow. How you where are you from? You're from here. Very nice. Thank you. Thank uh, you. Good boy, Oscar. Uh, okay. Salam alaikum. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, good. Alhamdulillah. Thank you. Thank you. Shukran. Shukran. Nice Shukran. to meet you. Shukran. Eh? Shukran. <laughs> Thank you. See you later. Bye. Bye. So we've just we've just learned that this is the old Bedouin market, which makes sense because there's stuff from all around the place. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's cool. It's very cool vibes. I would totally recommend definitely come into Al Balad and if you're in the right time to come down and see this market, it's buzzing. Wow, look at that waterfall. Okay, we've got to go and find it. this. We've got to go and find a good vantage point, but we can see the huge fountain over there as well. It's massive. It is massive. Traffic is just glorious. <laughs> glorious. <laughs> it's just. I'm on edge. I've got fingernail marks I know. the steering wheel. <laughs> I can see the huge flag from here in the distance over there, but I can't really multicast that much. Okay, I can see plenty of shots as well. All right, back with you. Okay, guys, here we are. We're at the biggest water fountain in the world. Saudi Arabia, Jeddah. Look at this. I don't know where everyone's gone, they've kind of left me. Look at this. Have you ever seen such a thing? Here it is, Harry. It's so cool. Have you ever seen such a thing? No. <laughs> I've only seen those tiny little fountains that just go like this. Yeah. They just go. Yeah. I mean, like this is high. massive. Wow. And if you've watched our Kuwait hospitality video, he shows us the oud wood thing. I'm not sure what it's called. Yeah. Mushka? Mush? Something like that. Yeah. yeah. And you put the oud wood in and it smells nice. That's that's what's blasting it out. Yes. How cool is that? Hey, where's so cool. where's Mum and Oscar? They're over at the ice cream. Wow! Look at this, man. This is so cool. Everyone's down here. Loads of cats. Having picnic. Everyone just just families everywhere. Yeah. I always like the cats chilling around. Pretty chill everywhere. I'll, I'll give. Uh, no, sorry. Some of these. No are problem. Give. I'll. You are my guest. Oh, Salam alaikum. I love much. you. Um, oh, thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, that's very kind. Thank you so don't much. Have any, don't have? These are from somewhere else. Oh, they're from. Come, come, come. They're from Bahrain. You can have it. <laughs> thank you very much. Thank you. What have we got oh, here? That's great. Oh, thank you, Shukran. That's really nice. He just said he's our warehouse guest and he's just given us these slushies for whatever coins I had. Uh, that's really nice. 
Alright guys, Bye. come on, we've got two slushies for the kids. They've been asking yes, for ages. You, happy. We are happy. happy. Very happy, thank you. I thank like every guest is happy. Thank oh, you. Thank you. That's thank you. Awesome. Yeah. Goodbye. Goodbye. Wow, look at this guys. Oh well guys, that's it. Oh um, no, that means it's the end of our last night in Saudi yeah, Arabia. It's the end of our last night in Saudi Arabia. And we'll give you some what? highlights. But what? wow, was it a good time here. It was. Oh, it was really nice, Oscar. What was it your was. biggest highlight? Um, uh, I liked Alaba, I liked, I liked going, to, I liked and... going to, um, um, staying at Muhammad's house. Oh, and, uh, very nice. where? Near Al, Al, Near Al Halaba. Yeah, Halaba. Near Halaba. We liked Abha, we liked yeah. Taif, we liked Riyadh. We had an awesome tour here in Jeddah. We met yeah. um, Hosni, we I, met Al Aziz and yeah. Riyadh. I think I like uh, the Mrs. Edge of the World. The Edge of the World, oh, Mr. Yes, Sard's Camel Farm in Demam. Yes, yeah. we've done so much here. We've done so what much. An amazing place. Well, we're going to sign off. Yeah, That's thanks for watching us. and we'll see you. Don't forget to like and subscribe. On our next destination. Yeah. See you all next day. Let's go. Yeah. Shukran, Saudi Arabia. Yeah.